Hi, today I'm going to be making almond biscuit bars. It's in three stages, so this is the first stage with the biscuit base, which is flour, sugar and butter. What we're going to do is combine them and put them in the bottom of the bowl ready for the oven. So we'll crack on with that. Some of the sugar, some of the flour. with butter. Right, all the butter's rubbed into the flour now, so it's like a fine breadcrumb texture. So what we'll do, we'll transfer that to a bowl. Before you transfer your biscuit base into the dish, just light your butter. Then in with the biscuit. What we want to do now is squash it down. It's ready for the oven. Right, the oven's preheated to 160 fan or 180 non-fan oven and we're going to bake this for about 15 minutes till golden. Hey Google, set timer, 15 minutes? Sure, 15 minutes, starting now. Right, while the first layer is in the oven baking, we're going to make the second layer with cream cheese, eggs, sugar and I've got some almond flavouring as well. So into a bowl with your cream cheese, your sugar, eggs, teaspoon of almond flavour. Right, mix this. Right, that's mixed now to a nice smooth creamy consistency with uh, no lumps. So that's ready to go on to the biscuit base once it's out of the oven. Right, that's been in the oven baking now for 15 minutes. So we'll go uh, put the top in the next stage. Just smooth that round. Uh, just give that a little shake, let it settle, and then we're going back in the oven now for another 15 minutes. Right, while the biscuit and the second layer are baking in the oven, what we're going to do is make the final topping. Put sugar in the bowl. And with a little, bu little butter. Some ground almonds and so a splash of milk. Just cream. Oh, that wasn't supposed to happen. Uh, just cream these together. If like mine. Uh, it's a little dry, what you can do is just put another splash of milk till it starts to cream. It doesn't help, but it's quite cool today so my butter's quite firm as well. Literally just a splash. Cream again. That extra splash of milk. We've got a nice thick butter cream. Stop. Out comes the second layer. Carefully. 
Right, that's the second layer baked. So what you'll need to do now is leave that to cool completely before you put the buttercream topping on. Otherwise, it'll melt the butter in the topping and it'll just be a disaster. So leave that completely to cool. Right, once the second layer has cooled, it's nice and firm. So we can go straight in with our buttercream topping. And just use your spatula or a knife. A little optional extra is so uh, sp light sprinkle of some salted almonds that have been crushed. It's not salty. No, light, lightly salted. They taste lightly salted to me. The almond biscuit bars are ready for slicing. That should be interesting. But uh, hope you enjoy.